So at CES 2026 here, I just wanted to do a quick little look at fridge power uh, up close and in some detail. I don't have one of these yet available uh, for personal testing and review, so this is going to be what we uh, have to look at it. I'm going to flip the camera around and we can look up close at some things. So fridge power itself is an 1800 watt inverter, two kilowatt hour system. It is, uh, in my impression, basically uh, based on the Elite 100. It has uh, very similar specs. It has a 1000 watt PV input, fridge power. Yes, it does have PV. It has a 1000 watt, uh, 12 volt, Six, I'm sorry, 60 volt, 20 amp, 1000 watt input. Uh, it has two outlets on the back, uh, 1800 watts total. It does have DC in. Uh, it, is, it has a two kilowatt hour battery instead of the one kilowatt hour battery of the uh, LEED 100. So this is uh, two, two kilowatt hours in here uh, and they're showing it with an expansion battery. And this is kind of a different scenario. Uh, you have a hidden connector system, so we have what sort of looks like an Anderson uh, 50 amp, and then there's a data connection. And the expansion battery then has a port of its own uh, to continue expanding. I think it'll take uh, three or four of these batteries. Uh, I recall the numbers I saw said uh, eight kilowatt hours in total. And the display on the fridge power is down here on the front side. So they have another unit. This. This is, a, this is a real unit here sitting on top of the fridge. It's not connected to anything, uh, but it is real. Uh, so this is what the display looks like here. It's just a button and some status lights. So what they've done with fridge power is they've created a separate uh, Bluetooth magnetic display that you can see uh, the room temperature, room humidity. Yes, it's very dry in Vegas. And input watts, output watts, state of charge. And this unit does have, uh, this is full featured. This is not just a standby UPS. This unit has PV priority. It has Wi-Fi. Uh, it has the solar input. So you can use this to actually save you money. And I'm considering other applications, like uh, it might be ideal as a, uh, alongside the desk or under monitor uh, computer UPS system. Uh, obviously the 1800 watt PV input on it there. Let me just put the camera around again. Obviously, the 1800 watt PV uh, uh, in inverter input on it is uh, more than enough for a fridge. You could probably, you know, run your coffee maker at the same time in an outage. Yeah, it's interesting. 